What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I am the Bald Ginger, and we are jumping back into some road to the show here today. It's a three-game set with the Atlanta Braves coming to town, closing out a nice long home stand here. And we're gonna see what we can do. Take two out of three, maybe sweep them. Let's find out. Bottom of the first, the Braves are already on top, two to nothing. Two outs, runner on first for me as I'm batting cleanup with a 302 batting average today. Mike Clevenger on the mound hits 97 on the four seamer. And uh, 96 on the sinker. That's all he's got that's quick. First pitch is a slider just off that outside corner. That was a really good spot for that. I wanted to swing at that so bad it wasn't even funny. But we didn't, so we have a 1-0 count to start this at bat. Next pitch, inside with a circle change. Looks like they're going to pitch around me more than just a little bit here. 2-0 pitch on the way from Clevenger. Ooh, got me to swing at the four-seam row off the inside corner. And it's a two and one count. I was way behind that to boot. Next pitch is a cutter above the zone. And it's a three and one count. Yeah, they are definitely pitching around me here. Trying to pepper the corners, but it's not working. Ooh, we take the four-seamer low and inside. That's a bad spot for me to swing at anyway. So now we have a full count. Payoff pitch from Clevenger. It's up above the zone. First base is mine for free. We draw a walk in the first half bat. We'll take it. Bottom of the third, we come back to it. It's a 5-3 to three lead for the Braves now. I'm standing in. No official at bat as I drew that walk earlier. Mike Clevenger still on the mound. Nobody out. Nobody on. Here we go. First pitch of the at bat. Four seamer on the outer third. Got a piece of that and fouled it away. Oh, and won the count. And they keep saying 2025 home run champion down there in the corner. Yeah, I know. Four seamer off the inside corner there, taken for a ball. That runs the count to one and one. Next pitch. Right down the middle with the four seamer. Late swing fouled off one and two the count. Coming after me just a little bit more in this at bat. Four seamer on the inner third, right at the top of the zone. Got a piece of that one and fouled it off. Count stays at one and two. Why the check swing, dude? Oh, come on. Oh, this game, I tell you. It literally just ran an update before I started playing this, and yeah. Check swings definitely are teabagging me already again. 6-3 to three the score now in the bottom of the fourth. Runners on the corners, one away as I'm standing in 0-1 for 1 on the day after the check swings rings me up. And there's one in the left center field. That'll get down for a base hit. That's going to score one. Uh, they better hold him up at third. Yep, runners on the corner still in the bottom of the fourth. It is now a 6-4 to four score. And uh, yeah, runs definitely not coming at a premium in this one. As they are all over the place. Bottom of the sixth, we come back 6-5 to five the score with Atlanta in the lead. I'm standing in one for two on the day with one out and nobody on. Archie Bradley now on the mound from the Braves out of the bullpen. He has a 96 mile an hour four seamer, 95 on the two seamer, and that's all he's got that's quick. First pitch is that knuckle curve on the outer third, swung on and missed. Oh, and won the count. I saw the wiggle and I still swung, swung at that one way too early. Two seamer low and inside, taken for a ball for uh, one and one count with pitch number two. Pitch number three is a four seamer on the inner third. Uh, got no chance of catching up with that one. One and two the count now. The two strike pitch from Bradley. Ripped into left field. That's going to get down for a base hit. That's going to go all the way to the wall. We got a double out of this one. Yeah, that'll be an easy double. We'll take that. Two hit game for me now. I like it. I like it a lot. Bottom of the eighth. We come back. Two outs. Nobody on. Seven to five the score with Atlanta in the lead. I'm standing in two for three on the day. Penn Murphy is now on the mound for the Braves. He hits 90 on his four seamer. Only 87 on the sinker. Wow. Slur hooks in and catches the inside corner. All right, you froze me with that one. Good pitch, good location. Oh, and won the count. Second pitch of the at-bat now from Murphy. Come on, big fella. Oh, Slur down the middle, but just above the knees. Swung on and missed. Oh, and to the count. Man, I was way out in front of that. 76 mile an hour pitch. My gosh, that's slow. Wasn't too late on that one. Sinker, but it's sent out to right center field. Going to get caught by the center fielder. 
That's going to be all she wrote for the eighth inning. We're heading on to the ninth, trailing the Braves by a score of 7-5. to five. And the Braves take the win here in game number one. 7-5 to five is the final score. So we've got to win the other two if we're going to win two out of three in this one. So, uh, yeah, let's move on to game number two, and you know what that means. This is where I remind everybody, if you haven't done so already, or if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. You can also like and comment on this video, as all of those things do help me out with the YouTube algorithm. So we're standing in for at bat number one here in the bottom of the first. Two outs, runner on second. Spencer Strider on the mound for the Braves. He hits 100 on the fourth seamer. 99 on the two seamer. First pitch. <laughs> That was horrific. Slider well off the plate, and I was way out in front of it, expecting that heater to start the A-B, but no, sir. It's a swing and a miss on a pitch way outside of the zone. Oh, and one the count. Next pitch is a four-seamer at the top of the zone. Swung on, missed, and uh, two swing and a misses makes for an 0 oh and two count to start this A-B. That was really late on that four-seamer to boot, so even if I made contact, it wouldn't have stayed between the lines. And he hits me with a slider off the outside corner. Three pitches, none of them in the zone. All of them swings and misses, and I am heading back to the dugout. And yeah, you can see the faces there. They're not thrilled about that one. Not at all. We come back bottom of the third. Still no score. Two outs and a runner on first for me as I'm standing in 0 for 1 on the day with that strikeout in my first plate appearance today. Spencer Strider still on the mound for the Braves. Slider in the zone there, cut on and missed. Man, good swing, timing, no contact. What the heck? There, I finally made contact with one, but it's one I shouldn't have swung at. Four seamer up above the zone, and I have an 0-2 count now. Next pitch from Strider. Yeah, I knew that slider was coming off the plate. One and two the count after finally taking a pitch outside of the zone from Strider. And he hits me with a slider again off the plate, and I swung on that one and missed. Two strikeouts for me on the old line score today, and that's going to end the third inning. Goodness me, not a great day at the plate so far. Top of the fifth, we come back to it, still no score. Nobody out, nobody on for Sean Murphy. He's 0 for 1 on the day and hitting a lowly 155 on this young season. He's got an 0-1 count against Eduardo Rodriguez. Let's see if we get a routine ground ball here. We do. We'll scoop that up, throw to first. They'll be in plenty of time. And that's the first out in the visitors' half of the fifth inning. We come back bottom of the sixth. I'm standing in for the third time today, 0 for 2, trying to avoid the hat trick against Spencer Strider. There's one out, nobody on, still no score here. Let's see what we get with the first pitch of the at-bat from Strider. Yeah, circle change just off the outside corner. Finally starting an at-bat with a 1-0 and o count. Could have had about three of those in this series so far. The 1-0 pitch inside. 2-0 and o the count. Wow. Okay. Let's see what we can do with a 2-0 pitch now from Strider. Right down the middle, and I lined it right to the first baseman. Ugh. You win some, you lose some, but it beats striking out, so we'll take it. It is what it is. We come back top of the seventh. Arizona is leading one to nothing now. Sean Murphy at the dish for the Braves. He's 0 for 2 on the day, 0 for 5 on the series. Nobody out, nobody on here. Eduardo Rodriguez throwing pitch number 86 of his outing. And we get a bunt. Oh, man. Well placed to boot, but he's not quick enough to beat that one out. We get the throw to first in time, beats him by a step. One away now in the top of the seven. We come back bottom of the eighth. Still a one nothing lead for Arizona. Two outs, runner on first. Joe Mantiply on the mound for the Braves out of the bullpen. He hits 92 on the sinker, 92 on the four-seamer. That's all he's got that's quick. First pitch is a four-seamer on the outer third. Got a piece of it and fouled it away. And that makes for an 0-1 oh count. Second pitch of the at-bat. Oh, sinker below the knees. Got a piece of it and followed away, but I was way out in front of it. And we have an 0-2 count yet again in this game. The two-strike pitch. Oh, got me. All right, throw to first. There we go. Two to three put out, completes the strikeout. As I have just been completely manhandled at the plate today. Still rocking the over after eight innings.
And the Diamondbacks are going to take the win here in game number two. One to nothing, the final score. Definitely a pitcher's duel. So we are tied at one game apiece. We're going to move on to game number three and see who can win the rubber match of this three-game series. I'd like to think we could do it. And after uh, three strikeouts in the second game, yeah, that's... Whew. I got to be able to do better than that. All right, game number three. Here we are, starting off. Ranger Suarez on the mound for the Braves. No score, two outs, runner on first. For me, as I'm batting cleanup with a 298 batting average. Suarez does throw a 95 mile an hour sinker, 96 on the four seamer, 90 on his cutter. And the first pitch is low and inside with that four seamer, one and oh, the count. My gosh, I'm a 189 career hitter against Atlanta. That is phenomenally bad. There's a rip in the left field, but that one's going to get caught. Ugh. Dang it. Hate it when you get a hold of one and nothing good comes out of it. So that's all we, she wrote for the first inning. We come back bottom of the fourth. Braves are up three to nothing right now. Runner on first, one away. I'm standing in 0 for 1 on the day today. Ranger Suarez still towing the rubber for the Braves. First pitch of this at bat from him. Ooh, 12-6 curve on the outside corner. Got a piece of it and fouled it away. It was really far out in front of that, despite thinking I held back more than enough for it. But the 0-1 pitch now from Suarez. Ripped into center field. That one's going to get caught. Yep, not quite to the warning track out there. And that is out number two in the home half of the fourth. Man, I am just not having any luck with the balls I can make contact with today. <clears throat> Top of the fifth, we come back, nobody out, nobody on. Orlando Arcia at the plate for the Braves. He's 0 for 2 on the day, despite hitting 341 on the season so far. He's managed to work a 2 and 1 count against Ryan Nelson. And a ground ball to me is going to continue his 0 for on the day as we throw across. Easy play, one away here in the top of the fifth. Bottom of the seventh, we come back. Atlanta is leading seven to nothing. Holy cow, Ranger Suarez still on the mound. Only thrown 67 pitches at this point in the game. Belly full of Cracker Jack. Let's see what I can do against Suarez. Mm, lazy fly ball out to right field. Right fielder barely has to move to catch that one. So, yeah, we're playing a glorified version of catch. <coughs> oh, man. <clears throat> there we go. Finally working out the kinks in my throat here, but uh, yeah, the Braves win this one. Eight to nothing as we get absolutely monkey stomped in this one. Nothing good to come out of game number three, especially at the dish for me. So yeah, I'm kind of glad to see this series get over with because we just got beat and beat profusely. <sighs> All right, series is over. Therefore, this episode is going to be over. For those of you still hanging out with me, thanks for being here. I really appreciate it. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, do all the fun social media things. We will see you in the next one.